another video. As you guys can see, I'm currently in my bathroom. So today's video is going to be a uh, hair routine. My hair looking a little messy right now. So I'm going to be telling y'all the products I put in my hair and what I do with my hair so I can get my natural look. It's old and dry right now. It looks nasty, but yeah. So we're going to jump right into this video. So the first thing we want to do before we start washing our hair is make sure we get the water to like a medium hot, more on the cold side than anything. So yeah, let's do that. So the shampoo that we're using today is going to be a Neutrogena brand, Honey Treasure. It basically it re, uh, repairs hair and, and basically straightens your hair and heals it from damage. So yeah, you only need like a dime size of pore portion. So this is how much we're gonna use today. I like to just put it in the front and some in the back. And basically just work it into my hair. And while you're washing your hair, make sure you scrub your scalp, get all the dry skin off, any dirt residue that's left like, like that's in your hair. Don't really worry about combing it at this point because once you put the conditioner in it, that's when we're gonna start combing it out. Scrub your scalp really good. After that, I like to put it like in four sections so I can like really do one half and not have to worry about the others. I like to use a lot, so if you're a girl and you're natural, then you understand like the shampoo. You're always gonna have more shampoo than conditioner. And I do the same thing with this. I basically put the conditioner in the front and in the back, and you know, work my way up to the middle of my hair. And I'm about to go blind because I got soap or something in my eye. work it all in. Like when I wash my hair with shampoo only it be felt all dry so I normally just put the conditioner in it, let it sit for like a couple minutes. So that's what we're gonna do for a little bit. Let it sit in. 
I'm gonna go ahead and comb it out right now. So we got, don't judge my brush job, but we got one of these natural brushes, like where one of these, like with these brushes, you could take the bristles out and you know clean it. But I can't currently get it out because my hands messed up. And you could take the bristles out and whatever, clean it. Go ahead, see, clean it out. So let's pop this right back in there, and I'm gonna take forever. There we go. And I'm gonna put this right back into place. And it's gonna work. So, in your brush. So yeah, that's what you do. So I'm going to let this sit in my hair for about probably 5 to 10 minutes. And I'll come back to you guys when the 5 or 10 minutes are up. So, until next time. It's been about 5 to 10 minutes, more probably like 9 minutes, but who cares? Who's got me? So what we're going to do, we're going to rinse these out now. Same thing, the water got to be more on the cold. The water got to be more on the cold side now since we're washing it. We Coming to a end to wash. Once I get all my products into the bathroom with me, so um, I went got all my products. I dried it off a little bit. So for the next part, what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna take this white tooth comb and comb out my hair. These comb are the best because it doesn't pull out as much hair as other comb. So yeah, let's get into it.
have Cantu Deep Condition Treatment. I'm going to also put this in my hair, but I'm not going to use this pack. I already have a pack open. So we're just going to use this. We're just going to squeeze some out. I'll probably end up using the rest of this bag. But who knows? So this is what it looked like. Like a white cream thing. So we're going to... treatment and it does a uh, condition treatment intense thing it helps restore hair dry and damaged hair restores in a boost with moisturize so that's why we're putting this in our hair Cantu is a very good brand if you are natural so with the rice water Rice water, you're supposed to let it sit in your hair for about 20 to 30 minutes. So I'm going to let this sit in my hair all together. And then we're going to go back to the tub and rinse it all out. So once this is all done, sit in for about 20 minutes, I'm going to come back to you guys. So yeah. Hey guys, so we're back and we're ready to rinse the deep conditioner and the, water, the rice water out of my hair. So yeah, we're going to do that. start from my bottom of my hair and work our way up to the top. curling milk. So these are the products that we're going to be using now. So the first one I'm going to use, I'm going to do the olive oil first. So what I do, I just drizzle it around the edges first. Make sure the top of my Just not too much, 
Okay. <laughs> so we're gonna put the regular oil in now. We're not gonna go around and end up dying, so I went ahead and put this in my hair already. It's already in my hair. I kinda break it into my scalp like this. But I wanted to get the oil in there before my hair ended up drying up. So the next thing it's gonna do be is this curling milk into my hair. I'm not gonna put much. Probably just a little something something. I feel like this is more than enough for today. So grab it in. Do a little scrunch up over here and then a little scrunch over here. That's what we're gonna do. Flip it over and do the same thing. Screech. Some people normally go in with a blow dryer or a diffuser, but I'm not gonna let do anything that anything like that. I'm just gonna let it basically air dry. So I'm gonna be back to you guys once it air dries. I'm probably just gonna end up adding pictures into that at the end of this once it air dries. So you guys see how it turned out. But please like, comment, and subscribe, and don't forget to hit the notification bell at the end of the video. Thank you and you guys have an awesome day.